Hey. Ta-da! Are these for me? No. What? Okay, what do we have here? Babe. Hey, baby. Babe, this is huge. I know, right? I'm so excited. Uh, babe, what's going on? Are you... I know it's not our anniversary. It's not my birthday. What are you planning? No. What are you plotting? Take a wild guess. Wait, let me guess. You are trying to surprise me? Or maybe you are giving me this in advance? No. It must not always be about you now. This is not for me? Yes. <laughs> Babe, who are you gifting? <clears throat> okay, let me just tell you so I don't spoil the form. This gift... Uh -huh. Are for Bella. <laughs> I know, right? Bella? Yes, Bella. Your friend? Mm-hmm. My best friend. Is he a birthday? No. I've known her for seven years now, so it's our seven years anniversary. So I got her this to make it her feel so special. I also got her a wine to seal our friendship. <laughs> Actually, I love this. This is so top to me. No. <laughs> uh, it's rare nowadays to see somebody that, you know, value their friendship. Uh, I love this. It makes sense. Thank you. I knew you'd love them. She will. I mean, who wouldn't? This, but, but, but babe, this is huge. Oh. This is a lot of money. Oh. No, Bella is worth every penny and even more. Mm. Yes, Bella. You, you have no idea, actually. So, Bella and I go way back. Bella is, Bella has been a friend, more than a friend. She's the only friend I've got that we will not never betray me she's the only friend i've got that got my back anytime any day she's the only friend i've got that that's that will still stick to me regardless she will never stab me in the back she will never speak ill of me she's what mommy i should even be ashamed of myself i'm getting hurt this yeah, baby it makes sense what you did is mm -hmm. it's cool i mean it's cool <laughs> but don't you think you are hyping bella too much like the friend that will never stab me in the back bella is a friend that will never betray me Babe, I just want to tell you that nowadays, no matter how close and how far you've come with a friend, do not trust somebody too much. Don't say that. Why? Why would you say a thing like that? I'm, I'm, I'm just trying to tell you not to like, you know, be too confident about somebody. You can only trust yourself. Don't ever say somebody cannot stab me in the back. Stuff like that. Okay? I'm saying so because I'm sure. It's something I know for a fact. Why are you so sure Bella cannot stab you in the back? I'm, I'm not saying she will, but like, you shouldn't be so sure. Babe, if you go on with this kind of mentality, this is how people get poisoned by their own best friend. Why would you even say a thing like that? I'm just saying, be careful. Have you not met Bella? I have met Bella and I'm, I'm not saying she's bad. I'm just saying, don't trust too much. Don't like, don't be overconfident about people. Just trust yourself and that's it. Bella is a human being and Bella could stab you in the back. That's not true. What could Bella possibly take from me? You don't know. Bella could be jealous of your life. She could be jealous of your work. Bella could even be jealous of your mom. She could want it. Bio! That's too far. I mean, Bella has been here several times. You've met her. Did, did she give you any body language or green light? <sighs> Babe, it's not until she do that. Okay. Let's, let's do this. Let's put Bella to a test. Mm -hmm. How do you intend to do that? It sounds ridiculous, but it's just the only way to convince you and know for a fact that Bella is not who you think she is. And she is who I claim her to be. We're going to test her with you. What? I know, I know, I know. <laughs> we just have to, like, Put you in the picture and let's see if she's going to try to give you green light or try to have you to herself. I don't even know why I'm doing this anyway, but I really want to show you and prove to you that. Babe. My girl. First of all, this is not happening. Secondly, this is insane. 
You want me to say this, Bella? Trust me, I'm too hot. Bella is going to fall for me, so I'm not going to do it. <laughs> Even if you are hot like a heater, Bella will still see you. Waka pass. Bella is not interested in anything that has no hers. Okay, babe. Hmm. How about we do it this way? Hmm? Since you are so sure about your friend, Bella, hmm? Mm -hmm. um, why don't we make a bet? I like the sound of that. Yeah. I mean, I already spent a fortune on this, so I need to recover my cash. Okay. Um, if Bella doesn't fall for me, <laughs> then I'll hold you 500 grand. <laughs> but babe, oh my god. If Bella falls for me, then you are owing me 500 grand, which, which I will collect immediately. There's no family, there's no relationship. Strictly business. Are you in? Deal. Huh. <laughs> My G. Give me a number. Sure. Hmm. Bella, Bella, Bella. My girl. Here. Hey, hey. 500 grand going down. I'm calling her. It's ringing. Mm -hmm. Hello? Hello? Um, good afternoon. Good afternoon. Please use this. Um, this is Biobeat. Am I speaking to Bella? Yeah, sure. This is Bella. Um, is it the Biobeat I know? Yes, the same Biobeat you know. Oh, okay. Hope everything is fine. How's Dara? Um, Dara is fine. She's all right. Actually, she went out. She, she went to get something and I had to like quickly get your number from her phone. Actually, I stole your number from her phone. Okay. Hope no problem. No problem at all. Actually, there's just something that has been bothering me and I need to speak to you about. Um, are you free to talk right now? Um, yeah, I'm free. I'm all ears. Okay. Actually, there's this dream I had, you know, a few days ago, I was sleeping and I, I dreamt about you. I mean, the first question that came to my mind is why you? But then let me tell you the dream. In the dream, you, you, you know, you were being attacked by so many people. You were being, you know, molested and I came to save you. So, you know, for in that dream, I was your savior. I, I took you away and I took care of you. So, I don't know how it happened. I don't just know. You know, the dream is just so funny to me and I just, I just need to tell you. Is there a way of this? No, she's not. Which is why I, I want to tell you about the dream. There's, there's actually more. There's more to it. But... I feel like it's not something we can discuss over the phone. So, so. yeah. So I think uh, I don't know if you'll be able to like come around here on Saturday. Are you free? Um, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not sure yet. I don't know if I'm um, I'm free. But I'll call you if I'm free. I'm going to let you know if I'll be able to come. Okay, please. I'll be expecting your call, but please, um, Bella, can you promise me that this conversation stays between me and you? Because I don't want my girlfriend to hear about this. Yeah, I promise. Thank you very much. I'll count on you, you know. Uh, I believe you'll be a woman of your word. Thank you very much, and I'll be expecting your calls. Okay, bye. All right, bye. What? My girl! <laughs> why, are you, why are you so happy? I'm a dead kid. What are you talking about? She said she'll call me back. Hey, go. Don't look for trouble where there's no trouble. Give me my money. I am not hungry. She, hey, she's hey, <laughs> Your phone is ringing. <laughs> if I think I call you my money. <laughs> Your phone is ringing. Bella. She's calling you. <laughs> she's calling me off course. I told you. My girl does not disappoint. Hey, baby. I'm fine, how are you? I'm fine, where are you at? 
I'm okay. Just went out to do little shopping. How far now? I'm fine now. I just called to like ask you if you'll be busy on Saturday. If I would be busy on Saturday? Yes. No, not really. Yeah, yeah, I will, Sha. You know, my mom moved now. I told you they moved to their new place and I've not been there. So I'm going to see her. Just want to say hi. Yeah, that's true. That's true. And hey, no problem then. I'll just go alone. Wait, what's happening? Do you want me to follow you somewhere? Yeah, I wanted us to go somewhere together, but... Okay, no, 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 no. It's, it's fine. I mean, it's, I can't see my mom any other day. Babe, never mind. Don't worry, I'll go alone. Ah, Bella, is everything okay? Yeah, everything is fine. I really want to go with you. Don't worry, I'll update you when I come back. Okay, take care. Bye, I love you. Bye. Wait. <laughs> Chill. So right now, she's going to come alone. Your friend has already ditched you. No, she didn't. She ditched you. She 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 just she's going to come to see me alone. Ah, oh, sure she's coming to see you. <laughs> Wait, are you? I've won this place. No, I know. I don't really understand. I have. I I won. She she. Oh, my phone. She's calling me. Bella, big, big, big. Shh. <clears throat> oh, hello. Um, you, what's up? Yeah, Bella, I, I mean, I was so happy that you called back. Um, okay, I already checked my schedule and I'll be free on Saturday. You will be free on Saturday? Yeah. So, does that mean I can expect you on Saturday? Sure. Okay. And uh, you promise not to tell Dara about this, right? I can't say for now. But I'm coming on Saturday. Um, Bella, I, I really... If you are going to come here, please, I want to make sure I know that you promised me that Dara is not going to know. Okay, so Saturday, right? Yeah, sure. Okay, Saturday it is. Bye, see you very soon. Bye. <sighs> Alright, babe, this is it. Look, I'm sorry. First of all, I know we started this as a joke, but uh, it's, it's starting to like, you know, look very awkward that you are saying that your friend could actually ditch you. This is not funny. I hate to be right all the time. I'm damn right and you know it. What, what if it was not Bella that spoke to you? That's Bella's voice and you know. Stop deceiving yourself. I'm so scary right now. See, just, um, it's gone. This is it, no, wait. She's coming so you guys can have a conversation about your dream. <sighs> Babe, stop being like this. I've won this. We are not going any further. What did you guys talk about? You told her you had a dream about her and you want her to come so you discuss it further. Man. She's coming to you. At least here you are. Then she'll just me about the dream. Babe, this is insane. That your friend just ditched you and you are here. You are still trying to like believe her. Do you want to go on? Yes. You want us to continue? <laughs> yes. Babe, round two. <laughs> this is never round two. I'm going to get my money from you. <laughs> Hi. Hi, Bella. Good afternoon. Yeah, good afternoon. Um, <clears throat> please come inside. Um, no. I thought you said you wanted us to talk. Actually, talk okay. here. Come on, Bella. We are, I mean, we are mature people, and you know that it's not proper for me to speak to you at the door. Yeah. Come on, Bella. Come inside. I don't bite. Okay. Yeah. To your right.
Please have your seat. Okay. Sit down. Thank you. Um, Bella, mm? I'm so happy that you um honored my invitation. So, uh, Bella, mm? what can I offer you? Drink, um, food, anything, just name it. No, I'm fine, actually. Because you said you wanted us to talk, that's why I'm here. Yeah, I know, but it doesn't mean I shouldn't offer you anything. I'll just offer you something, then we'll go to the discussion. I'm fine. Are you sure? Yeah. It's not like you're shy or something? Mm -mm. No. Because I know how you always be when you come, whenever you come here with Dara. You're, you're being a little bit shy right now because you're not really yourself. I'm fine. Okay. So, um, I, I know this is very awkward. Uh, see, the thing is, Bella, I, I, I know this kind of feels wrong, but trust me, what I saw in the dream feels so real. It's the realest thing I've ever seen in my own sleep. You know, I, I saw you with, you know, having problems and I was the one that saved you. I know it's just a dream, but what a dream. And the question I ask myself is, um, why me? And why you? There's, they've got to be some, something. They've got to be some explanation, which I would like to find out. And this is why I've decided to call you. I, I, I'd like to get to know you. You know, I need to spend more time with you, getting to talk to you. And I don't know. And I want to be able to do this without my girlfriend knowing. I'm sorry I have to put you through this, but please, can you like help me achieve this? Okay. So. Basically, what I'm just trying to say is, is there any way we could like connect more? I like to see you more often. Whenever Dara is not around, I'll call you. I mean, you can secretly be saying, then she doesn't know about it. Go out, like you know, just those opportunity for me to be getting to know you and all that. Okay. Okay. Thanks. You're welcome. Actually, you're actually very nice. Thank you. Actually, I was actually folding my clothes. I was just trying to arrange a few things in the room before you came. And you're also sweating. I think this AC is not... Yeah. Would you like to like... Let's, let's go to the room. Let's discuss. Let's... Okay. Yeah, let's go. Come on. Get up. Are you shy? No, I'm not. Okay. <laughs> So you have nothing to say. Now you are speechless. No more mouth. Your so-called Bella, your best friend, has failed you. She has betrayed you. And I told you, stop saying this person can't do this, this person can't do this, because anybody could fall for temptation. Don't just, you know. I hope now you are you, you understood where I'm coming from. Well, at least you understood my point with some BC. Now you have to pay me my 500 grand. Thank you. 500 what? Yes, babe. You, you have nothing to say. She betrayed you. She betrayed your trust. She didn't tell you. She ditched you and she came to my place. Well, she only respected you by honoring your invite. I'm very sure she didn't want to stand you up or something. What are you talking about? She respect me by honoring my invitation and she ditched you. She didn't tell you, her best friend. Do you know that if this was actually real, if this was not a test, I could have had sex with her. That's how I could have, you know, before you know, we are dating, you know, before you know, she don't betray you. Before you know, you are not, nowhere to be found. No, you can't say every other thing about Bella, but having sex with her, 
it she can't go that extent jesus christ no i'm not defending her it's just it's just simple logic she yes. she respects me she won't betray me to that extent i'm very sure i'm quite sure let me tell you what i noticed you know? your friend is a, is she's she's a kind person she's very soft exactly easy to access she literally do everything i tell her like let's go to the room she goes she, look if i if i try to have sex with her it will happen by Bella is not that kind of person. Bella is actually that kind of person. So now you are owing me. You should pay me. Huh? Yes, she's that kind of person. She will do anything. She will betray you over and over again. Do you need any more tests? Yes, actually. Yes. Okay, okay. Let's do it like this. Let's let's switch. What do you mean by switch? You try and have sex with her and see if she will oblige. I'm not doing that. Give me my 500 gram. Thank then you. you're not ready to collect your 500. Okay. Wait, are you are you trying to play games? You've not proven that she betrayed me. She betrayed you already. By coming to visit you. You want me to try access with Bella? Yes, that way we would know if she really betrayed Babe, me. Because I promise you it will happen. I promise you it will not happen. And there's only one way to find out. Let's double the money. One M. Okay. I'm calling her, so she's coming here tomorrow. Hi. Thanks for coming. Bella. Hi. Well, I can see you have made yourself comfortable. I love that. So, um, <clears throat> you look so good. Thank you. Actually, I asked you to come because I have something more important to discuss. Okay. And I really hope this goes exactly the way I expect it to go. Okay. It's similar. I... I like you. Her eyes, her eyes make the stars look like they're not shining. Her hair, her hair falls perfectly without her trying. She's so beautiful and I tell her every day. Yeah, I know, I know When I compliment her, she won't believe me And it's so, it's so sad to think that she don't see what I see Every time she asks me, do I look okay? I say When I see your face There's not a thing that I would change Cause you're amazing just the way you are And when you smile The whole world stops and stares for a while Cause you're amazing Just the way you are Hello, babe. This is the second day that I'm calling and testing you. You are not replying. I sent you a bunch of voice notes. You are not replying to any of them. What's going on? I can't see you. What's going on? I've been trying to reach you. Please call me back. You are receiving my test messages. You are not saying anything. 
Is this about your friend and all this test shit we did? You made me do them, babe. Please talk to me. I mean, I, I've been testing you. You've not replied my test. You've not been picking your calls. I, I can't reach you. What's going on? Come on, babe. Don't tell me you are mad at me. Don't tell me you are angry. For this test, because it was all your plan. You, 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 you brought the idea. You wanted us to do it. Babe, and I kept asking questions. Is it fine? Should we go on? And stuff like that. Then why all of a sudden? Why do you want to stop talking to me? Why do you want to? Are you trying to break us? Yes, it's it's true that it was all a test. It was a test for my friend, apparently and initially. Mm -hmm. But as time went by, it became a test for you. It was not my own test because I was following your order. I mean, you asked me to do it. You asked me to do everything, right? So if I asked you to drink poison or put your hand into the fire, would you do it? Babe, 